voice was crying. Your doom is near at hand. Isugur's bane is found. Never before has any voice uttered the words of that tongue here in Imladris. I do not ask your pardon, Master Elrond, for the black speech of Mordor may yet be heard in every corner of the West. The ring is altogether evil. It is a gift. A gift to the foes of Mordor. Why not use this ring? Long has my father, the steward of Gondor, kept the forces of Mordor at bay. By the blood of our people are your lands kept safe. Give Gondor the weapon of the enemy. Let us use it against him. You cannot wield it. None of us can. The One Ring answers to Sauron alone. It has no other master. And what would a ranger know of this matter? This is no mere ranger. He is Aragorn, son of Arathorn. You owe him your allegiance. Aragorn. This is Isildur's heir. An heir to the throne of Gondor. How about that, Lewis? Gondor has no king. Aragorn is right. We cannot use it. You have only one choice. The ring must be destroyed. And what are we waiting for? <laughs> <laughs> cannot be destroyed, Gimli, son of Gloin, by any craft that we here possess. The ring was made in the fires of Mount Doom. Only there can it be unmade. It must be taken deep into Mordor and cast back into the fiery chasm from whence it came. One of you must do this. One does not simply walk into Mordor. Its black gates are guarded by more than just orcs. There is evil there that does not sleep. And the great eye is ever watchful. It is a barren wasteland, riddled with fire and ash and dust. The very air you breathe is a poisonous fume. Not with 10,000 men could you do this. It is folly. Have you heard nothing Lord Elrond has said? The ring must be destroyed. And I suppose you think you're the one to do it. And if we fail, what then? What happens when Sauron takes back what is his? I will be dead before I see the ring in the hands of an elf. Come on, Lord. 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 Lord.